Challenge Rift 250. Looks like a monk. You can click on the soul mirror. It'll reveal everything you need to know. This time around, we're playing Thousand Raiment of a Thousand Storms here. Full six-piece set. We'll quickly go through what it does. So spirit generators have a 25% chance increased attack speed and 400 percent increased damage so it's basically going to be using our primary damage dealers here which also generate spirit so we're not gonna we shouldn't be running out of spirit but we'll get into that a bit later because you can run out run out of spirit if you dash too much which brings us to the four piece set dashing strike spends 75 spirit but refunds the charge when it does so as you can see you can infinitely dash you don't run out of charges there's no cooldown but you will run out of spirit and apart from the primary damage dealer, the Deadly Reach, there's no real good way to replenish your spirit. Nothing here at all. Okay. Unfor oh shit, unfortunately. I didn't mean to go in there. <laughs> We're going through the six-piece set. So, six pieces, the, the bonus set is your spirit generators increase the weapon damage of Dashing Strike to 60,000%. What a crazy number. 60,000% for six seconds and Dashing Strike increases the damage of your spirit generators by six thousand percent for six seconds so when you dash strike you'll see when we're inside the actual challenge rift there's a little buff that appears um, for six seconds so keep an eye on that as long as that's active you can dash into like packs like so and then once you start using deadly reach see that that's the icon i was talking about right there once it runs out just use dashing strike again and it'll replenish and you got another six seconds and then also as you dash into enemies, you do extra additional damage also. So keep an eye on that big bicep there. Um, when it disappears, use dashing strike again, and that's how you make it reappear. Also, activate sweeping wind. So sweeping wind is also part of this build, part of the raiment set. And that'll keep um, building up stacks there, which will increase the damage that you do also. But don't forget to keep dashing striking. Especially when you come across an elite, make sure you use a dashing strike. Dashing strike does initial damage itself, but also you want that buff up there at all times. And as they're attacking enemies, as you can see, you keep on replenishing your spirit. But if you come across little straight areas with no enemies, like here, you, you'll be tempted to dash. I would say don't, because you're just going to run, run out of spirit, and you might be in a bit of trouble when you come across an elite, and you won't have... Um, enough spirit to dashing strike to get that buff up if that makes sense anyway one thing to talk about it another thing to do it together let's go on in let me know what time you all got in the comments down below good luck let's go so I activate sweeping wind first um, this is like an empty area to begin with don't worry too much about trash if there's only like um, one two or three enemies around you want to look for groups to kill Obviously, elites is what you primarily want. So over here, elite. And be careful of the explosions. You don't want to hang out in explosions, they will kill you. Trust me. I know. Been playing this game for a while. Get those. What I do though... There's actually so many explosions in this rift, it's not funny. What I do is try and get the orbs before the explosions go off. And then get the hell out of there. Just be careful, if you're low on spirit, you may not be able to get that additional dashing strike to dash out of explosions. So just be super careful. Ah, uh, that's a dead end, I believe. We'll keep on going this way. And just keep on moving forward. Condi pylon. Always a nice one. Should be an elite here somewhere, there is. Again. Oh, it's a freaking shielder. The bane of my existence. I hate these guys. But that's alright. We took him down pretty easy. Um, so speed pylon will give us a bit of a movement speed increase here. And we'll just utilize the end of the condi pylon. I'm going to go downwards. You can also go the other way. You'll kind of end up um, in the same area. Which will be... To the west here, to the west, to the west, to this way here. But I think um, going down is better because I came across that elite when I jumped in and just had a quick look to come up with a route and found that elite. 
Yum, yum, yum. As you can see, damage not a problem as long as you hit dashing strike before you dam um, attack enemies. Pretty damn easy. Yita! Keep on moving forward. Another elite here. And you gotta make sure they're within reach so you can hit them with your um, primary damage dealer, obviously. It would be good if there was like another good ranged ability that we were able to use, but there isn't. Something like Wave of Light or something. But it is a primary damage build and there's nothing very ranged in the primary damage department for the monk. Um, Alright, let's not die. Dying is not fun for anybody, right? So lots of juicy orbs there, just gotta be careful of those explosions. And the Molten. And we'll keep on going. Finally a decent map, the first two were quite shit. But if you don't want to die, don't get hit. You do have Seren Serenity here, which you can activate, it'll prevent all damage taken. For X amount of time. Uh, not sure if there's an elite here. No. Nah. Oh, but it's okay. We got the Rift Guardian. We got the moves. We got the moves. So same sort of thing. Oh, shit. Make sure that you activate Dashing Strike. But don't die. Be careful. His poison does do a lot of damage. But we got him. Just like that. For the Rift Guardian, if... When that poison pool hits the floor, I recommend just hitting your serenity and that'll definitely decrease. It'll give you a protective shield for four seconds and that way you can just do a quick dashing strike. Hit him with your deadly reach, your primary damage dealer with that enhanced uh, damage that you get and you should not have a problem. Just like that. What time did y'all get?